take a couple of good long deep in and out breaths and make up your mind that you're going to stay with the breath each time it comes in, each time it goes out. If your thoughts wander off, you don't have to follow them. You stay here with a sensation of the breathing. This is how you make this an auspicious day. The Buddha was asked, you know, how do we know which days are auspicious and which ones are not? And he says, the ones where you're really practicing, those are the auspicious days. doesn't matter what the stars are like, doesn't matter what the calendar says. What matters is the fact that you are really trying to look into your mind and straighten it out a bit. Try to keep watch on what's going on. Now, to keep watch, you have to have a, a place to watch, just like a watchman needs his spot. If the watchman is wandering around all the time, then people can sneak, sneak around. But if he's got a good spot that everybody has to go past, then he's going to see everybody coming in, everybody going out. As the Buddha said, mindfulness is a watchman. Make sure that there's no other entrances into the fortress. It's just that one big gate into the fortress. Okay, you have the the watchman stay, stay there. It's the same with the mind. You want to stay right here in the present moment because everything has to come through the present moment. When you're thinking about the past, you're doing it in the present moment. When you're thinking about the future, you're doing it in the present moment. And so try to keep your awareness right here, right where the mind and the body meet at the breath. That's when you know you're in the present. You can watch what's happening. Watch what's happening in the body. Watch what's happening in the mind. What things are coming in through the eyes, ears, nose, tongue, body. What things are coming out in terms of your thoughts and your words and your deeds. And you want to stay right here and keep watch over these things. And if you see something that's unskillful, okay, you don't let it pass. If there are things out there that if you look at them, you're going to get into trouble. If you listen to them, you're going to create greed, aversion, and delusion. Okay, then you don't listen to them. You don't look at them, at least not in that way. Try to look at them in another way. If you can't think of another way to look at them, just don't look for the time being. As for things coming out, if you see that anything you say is, or do or think is going to cause harm, you don't do it. So watchman is not, the watchman is not just watching, but also keeping control of things. Why? Because your actions determine the way your life is going to go. And where are you doing those actions? You're doing them right here, right where you're watching. If you keep watch like this, whatever comes up in the present moment, you're there, you're there, you're there. That's when the Buddha says that this is an auspicious day, which means that you have the power to make every day an auspicious day. And it's good to start right now with this day right here, whatever the day is.